Here are Clove's best clips back when he was still 16 years old playing for Dunya Games, and where he showed that he was completely ahead from other players in Garena at that period. Be really good for them as the Dunya Games gets a hold of the hard point. Yeah, but as soon as they said that, there's going to be a double cluster. But Clove takes him out, shuts them down. But Eric, they're still actually in the game. They can still make the comeback. But Clove is on a roll. Gets another one. Gets another one. Double kill for Clove. Can he make it more? This man is a walking highlight. And he's on a tear. 25 kills. Can he get more kills to his name? 20 seconds. DG will get control of the hill. But JG, I just get the trade. But Clove still gets another one. No one can shut him down. Someone, someone stop this kid, B. Stop him. Please. My goodness. Takes it down, and ZZ will go in for that shutdown shot as well. Globe on here with the pop, quick thermite, and with that shutdown, KRM, just like you said, be so untouchable. Yes, actually, and as you can see, as soon as you said that, DG actually about to cap B. Well, actually, does not manage to cap B, but Globe takes out one, does cap B, and takes out another one. What is this guy on? I, I, I don't know. Is he using a controller? Or a keyboard can someone pl plug it out already but, but you know as you can see even with them actually close with, with 22 the nrx points are still there you know it's only 30 point lead they can still manage to come back but you know the kills are all coming to dg side you know nrx has to string up a lot of kills and here comes the predator missile takes out three off the spawn no spawn protection for you and just like that he's already up to 26 kills what is going on <laughs> And it's going to be the 30 club right soon as we see friend. the Dunya boys going for that triple cap. Yes, they do get that. Like that. We see here Dunya Games being able to infiltrate this next hard point. And again, Cloak with that three piece, with that four piece, that quad kill over here. Again, will he get a fifth? Yes, he gets a fifth. An amazing, amazing play here by Clove. What a beautiful, erratic gameplay here by Clove. And we did expect it with a guy like this. Get that early rotation. I see. I, I think, uh, yeah, they're going to have a hard time. But Clove here just trying to take control of P2 on his own. Takes out two. There you go. The hill is open, but no one is in there. Clove is trying to make it. Gets three. Gets four in a row. Wow. Clove gets that last one. Be able to see them make a comeback in here. Astro, one shot, one kill. A lot has been lined up in front of them. And Clove just so amazing with the three Ps. Right back to back. Gehog has the fourth one oh as my. well. Are we going to be able to see him pop off a little bit more? UAV does assist him to get the third eye in the sky. And Globe will reposition himself. Go back in there. Get his fifth piece as well. And move out. Six, six one. Yes, dimana Clove berhasil mendulangkan dua pemain, tiga pemain, oh my god, bantingannya sungguh cepat sekali, namun kita lihat Ocha udah mulai masuk, dan ternyata di belakangnya ada... ...taken, especially when you are being uh, forced so far away to respawn, and they are going to the next hard point, uh, as, uh, so so early as you can see, Junior Games, they just abandon their point and go to the next one. That is what you call a very, very dominant team in this kind of mode. Dunia, maksud gue Almighty di sana, tapi C nya ditukar. Gawalisa di sana, si Adam mencoba maju, tapi A dan juga C gak jadi tertukar. Namun dua capture di sana, SPBU menjadi respawn dari tim Almighty. Yap, ini dia, guys. Selain bakalan langsung jadi responnya Almighty saat ini. Gak ada side yang tertukar. Yang ada adalah bawang dan bawang putih yang tertukar di sana guys dan ternyata kita bakal langsung recap recap kali ini udah sekitar setengah let's go si menuju ke arah tim deg kali ini dan ternyata heaven berhasil ditumbangkan begitu juga shut up bakal langsung jadi kill yang kedua oleh seorang clock bakal langsung dinyalain aja satu oh, penggunaan air sia dan ini dia wuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuu
Now, DG's actually in A, but now Sharper only has one flag, but I think they just have to tap on it because DG's not trying to defend it. But Clove here with the War Machine will defend it. Big kills coming to Clove, two kills with his War Machine. Very huge kills. Make that three. No, we are getting players. And they just kind of catch up and overtake on the scoreboard. 79 to 116. It's, and all of a sudden, it doesn't look like it is impossible. Doing a game with their fight package. And so, with the War Machine, arrest right in. Yeah, they want to get to the firefight. Up close to first of all, Clove gets one. Ehan takes out Irfan. And just like that, 3v4. That could be the mistake that they had to choose. They had to choose A. Bomb is down and Clove takes out two. ZZ takes out. Dan tampaknya, Team Astro masih belum bisa merebut hardpoint ketiga. Karena Clove juga udah mulai mengaktifkan sebuah war machine. Dima satu orang lagi juga harus tumbang di arah bawah. Dan Clove juga mulai mengaktifkan sebuah shock arti yang membantunya memenumbangkan satu orang. The spawns are in Dunya Games' favor as they actually spawn right behind and I think they're gonna have to make that rotation into the next hardpoint and really let this one go. Astro has a little bit of a lead but it is trickling down little by little as DG is getting those points. Again, they're gonna have to go for that rotation off of Key. DG, they put a cluster strike right before they actually got the Goliath so they couldn't go near it so that, that's why they were able to actually get that P1 and now heading in over to P2 again Oh, it's going to be very hard. Dig it, and ternyata C nya berhasil di clean up. Namun, namun ternyata Kong masih bersembunyi di sebuah ruangan. Yes, that is true. This open hard point is actually the contest hill. And let's see what they can do. Can they get the type of Clove on a loose again? Get them. Mereka tapi lo lihat, dan berhasil. Ternyata berhasil selamat maksud gua. Tapi lo lihat tersisa seorang Ivar sendiri. Kali ini Clove. With Almighty was completely amazing here. They were able to actually go here, but then Globe, how did he go inside the house? How was he able to actually get that? Oh no, you're in trouble right now, buddy. Yeah, you go. Even Dead Sky had to kill himself because he couldn't take it. The Raptor DNS just way too good. Globe won. I have a hard time with that. So it's gonna come down to that score streaks and also the operator skills at the later. Almighty players. Clove didn't push there. That was very, very smart of him. Versus one on the domination, you can pick the points up. We know hard point in it only starts after the hundred point. Patient and wait for all those cluster strikes to actually be out. Because right now, B is almost halfway full to actually go into DG's favor right now. Back and the markers cleared off as well. But Astro one shot one go. kill. They will collect those points. Yes, uh, do we, uh, do, uh, we see Clovis actually in the front of the line, gets a two-piece. Well, Astro is just going to have to hold it down for them to win it too. 92-134. It looks like this that one point might be enough for Astro, but it's cutting it too close. This is too risky. Astro, one shot, one kill. They need another point. Reason why you went extinct and you should have never... Come. How it actually happens. 5341. Are we going to be able to see Almighty pick that spot back up once again? Approaching that 100 point glove, and we're just in the second hard point, which is crazy. Yeah. A very amazing effort if Almighty actually pulls this off, because we see here the ops are being used. The operator skills are very early right now for Dunya Games. And we will know maybe around the 50 or 60 point mark. Yeah, in the, in, the, in the second half, that's where we're actually going to see it. But then we know Astro, they do not give up at all. And right now, they have a fire up their bumps. They're going to have to do really, really well, twice as well. But then it Ooh. is match point. It's game. Slowly come back to the same thing. But Clove, look at this, man. Junior Games, unrelentless, not letting go of the White Warehouse. They want to finish it, and they want to finish it fast. They want to finish it now, because they are already... But Sharper has control. 30 seconds, this is huge time, but Clove takes out two, takes out three. It's just so damn hard to kill. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the godly gameplay from Almighty doesn't seem to be that effective. Oh, but Guitar, once again, so, so good at that White Warehouse. Clove can make the difference. As Dunia Games continues to pick up those points, but as those time runs out, for you don't you don't even have time to actually position yourselves. It is almost like they have no strategy in here. But looking at that, it's all working for the start of Dunia Games because they have got the entirety of the hard points so far. And That's you your only reason because he's gonna be aggressive. He's gonna be up in your face all the time. And look at him pulling out this war machine. Perfect timing actually because he knows all the Astro Boys are here and just trying to take them out. Yeah, taking down, I believe. They taken down two before being taken out but the damage has been done as well i believe bravo is going to take uh, gonna be taken 
but you do RSG as well. But Club with a wall machine said no to that. There is play, and now the rotation is gonna come in, but this is gonna be the most important kill. The transitional gunfight from the rotation. Well, 10, 10 more seconds in here, and Astro oh, won't even complete it. Prevented by Dunia Games, and even those last few seconds will be picked up. Amazing play, amazing effort by Dunia. Right now, we can see them struggling in terms of those gunfights coming up like mushrooms, popping out of nowhere very randomly.